This math knowledge practice test question for the ASVAB and PyCat says, simplify 2 times 2x to the third in parentheses all squared. Again, on the ASVAB and PyCat, you're not given a reference sheet or a calculator. For that reason, I'd recommend you get in the habit of copying things down and working them out on your own scratch paper. Now, as we uh, simplify this expression, we have to pay close attention to the order of operations, especially as we get started. Uh, I remember the order of operations using the acronym PEMDAS or the mnemonic device. Please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. We're going to do parentheses first if there's anything in parentheses to do. Exponents next. Multiplication and division as they appear in the expression from left to right. And then finally, addition and subtraction as they appear in the expression from left to right. That is to say they're treated as equals. In this case, we do have parentheses, but we don't have any operations occurring in parentheses. That said, we do have an exponent that we're going to start with here. And in order to apply this exponent, we have to know the power rule for exponents. The power rule says if you have b to the x raised to the y power, that's going to be the same thing as b to the x times y power. That is to say you multiply their exponents. And technically, there is a 1 right here. So let's disregard this 2 for a second. Let's keep working out what's in parentheses. This becomes 2. Again, we're going to multiply the exponents. So this is going to be 1 times 2 power x. What are we going to do? We're going to multiply their exponents 3 times 2 power. All right, let's work this out. This becomes 2 times 1 times 2 is 2. So this is 2 squared x. 3 times 2 is 6. 2 squared is the same thing as uh, 2 times 2, which is 4. So this becomes 2 times 4x to the 6th. Uh, what operation do we have left? Again, we just took care of our exponents. The only thing we have left is multiplication. 2 times 4x to the 6th power is going to be 8x to the 6th power. So the answer to this one is D.